The Olympic torch relay paraded through Kuala Lumpur on Monday, making the city the 13th leg in its worldwide tour. The president of the Olympic Council of Malaysia, Tunku Tan Sri Imran Tunku Jaffa, said the nation is very proud to be a part of the relay. We are very proud to be part of this unique occasion and this unique celebration. Kuala Lumpur was chosen to host a leg of this relay in honour of the city's special place on this Olympic silk route. Tunku Imran began the torch run at Tadara Medeka about 2.30 p.m. Other torch runners included athletes, officials and prominent public figures. Well, for me, it's a big honour. I mean, I always wanted to be an Olympian. Obviously, I never will be. Approaching the end of the relay, heavy rain started to pour, but it didn't extinguish the flame or the spirit of the torch runners and the crowd. Sultan of Perak, Sultan Aslan Shah, was the final torch runner. He received the flame from the Chinese ambassador to Malaysia, Chen Yonghua. Sultan Aslan Shah then lit the cauldron to signify the end of the torch run in Malaysia. The flame's next stop is Jakarta, Indonesia. Meanwhile, at Tatara Medeka earlier, a Japanese man who unfurled a Tibetan flag was interrupted by a group of pro-China supporters. Police then intervened and took the man and his family away. Police said they were released later after questioning. Lee Miyuk, The Star, Malaysia.